Yeah, it's become light. I've been up all night again. Hello, everybody. We're so glad to see you. Maybe I won't go to sleep. I'll just mow the grass and do all that and take a shower. Maybe, who knows? Maybe I'll be tired then. Maybe I will go to sleep. I don't know. If I just lay down, it better be really soon so that I don't waste too much time. Dishwasher has one of those little stick on hooks on it. And I made a clean and dirty sign, but it, it was so worn it broke. So I'm making another one. I took a lid off of something and I'm painting one side blue. The other side's going to be red. When the blue side shows to the front, when you walk up to the dishwasher and you see the blue, you know the stuff inside's clean. When it's red, which I haven't painted on it yet, when it's red, you'll know that the dishes inside are dirty and need to be cleaned, and maybe it's not full enough yet. So as soon as you start the dishwasher with the dirty dishes inside, you flip it over. Now you can get them in the store that are magnetic, but the front of my dishwasher is not metal. And I could put it on the refrigerator, but kind of out of sight, out of mind type of stuff. Especially when you get older. And when I was at the they call it five below. It's usually uh, things that cost five dollars or less in increments of dollars. Really cheap crap. But I've been thinking of this for a long, long time and I couldn't quite figure out how to do it. But they had these. Kid, we, t you know, you take trips and stuff and you're in the car. In those days, you didn't have an iPhone or an iPad or movies project thing projected on your in your car you didn't have any of that so you either had to look out the window or sing songs or whatever this is what we used to do they had these when I was a kid too it explains how to do it on the back it's car bingo when you pass an antenna you close the little door and you pass the school you close the little door the one in the middle is always a free. It gives you a free one. You see a fire hydrant? Eh, he doesn't want to close, but you close it. And then you'll see a low clearance sign, and you close it, and you go bingo. So, yeah. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to print up a, a paper or something. I'm not I was going to take it apart, but I don't think I could get it back together if I took it apart. I'm going to print up a paper, and instead of park, convertible, antenna, whatever I'm gonna write eggs, bread you know it'll be my grocery list so if I need bread I close it so you can see that I need bread if I need eggs I'll close it so you'll see that I need eggs pretty cool huh? from right now I can tell you I'm not gonna get through the list happy day this is my to-do list there's a smiling sunshine the lawn. Gather the sticks because they fall out of the trees and they're all over the place. If I have time, when they dry up, then I will break them up and put them in little boxes. I can use them for barbecue or just burn the hell out of them and, and dance around the fire, right? Car. I need to vacuum it. I've hauled the lawnmower in a couple times. There's grass in there and all kinds of stuff. I need to clean it up measure inside of it to see what I can haul with me when I go to California. I want to be able to take my keyboard and I really don't trust it in a uh, you store it box it gets tousled. Um, detail and wash it. The rugs in here they need to be cleaned again and I've got this new Hoover Power Dash. I bought it for out in California because it's smaller and it's supposed to really work well. I'm going to try to clean the rugs see what happens. Hair dye. Um, I'll do that. Shower. I've got a picture. A drawing of me in the shower singing. <laughs> Sewing. I've got bathing suits and dresses to sew then I'll put all that stuff away. Clean up, sort of declutter and downsize and all that good stuff and most of all smile 
Right now it's 59 Fahrenheit, 15 Celsius. Kind of chilly almost there, you know? I'm going to have to put a night shirt on. I've been sleeping sans vestiti, which means without clothes, for several nights. But I just may have to put on a night shirt. I am going to make today's vlog really, really, really short. Because I'm going to be busy doing junk. If I vlog anything, you'll see it later. But uh, it's like I'm falling behind and I have stuff I really have to do. And who wants to sit and watch long vlogs anyway? Nobody. I mean, I subscribe to quite a few people and all of a sudden everyone's doing live vlogs and they're two hours long, three hours long. It's like, like that one girl says, ain't nobody got time for that. <laughs> I mean, I like you people, but I, even if I were laying in bed all day long or an invalid, I just can't, my brain won't take that. So sometimes I have to skip some people that I subscribe to because I know it's, you know, well, Josh Alexander, he washes dishes and talks and when you go live, this is a, a, a hint for people that are monetizing, when you go live, you have the potential to have more people or people clicking in to see what's going on and everything time that kind of stuff happens. Uh, it counts as views. And it doubles or triples your amounts of views or whatever. I don't know. The thing I really don't like are people that, I mean, I'm sorry. It sounds like, you know, the beggar that stands on the corner with the poorly written cardboard sign. People that sit and want you to pay on Patreon for them. That bothers me. Now, if you watch someone enough, you know whether or not they need help. But these people that are doing fine and they're always managing to buy this and buy that and do this and go here and go there. And they talk about knowing all these other big YouTubers and stuff. And it's like, and then they ask you for money. Uh, that's kind of really... Yeah. Sorry. Anyway, I'm going to... I'm starting to get a little bit of a headache. Um, I don't know if I'm going to do any more. Just lie down for a while. I think that's what I'll do. Then I'll get up and do the lawn and all that good stuff. And maybe I'll check back in later. Happy Thursday. See you later. Upward and onward.